Tugazani, I am Poverty Mu and I welcome you. Um, on this video, I'll be talking about relationships and their imprints, you know. Um, I think this is something that is often overlooked and we don't discuss it a lot and we don't, you know, work around it and assist people accordingly and with with help or rather, you know, when it comes to that. Because um, with every relationships, with every relationship, there is rather an exchange, you know, of spiritual DNA. There is an exchange of spiritually, you know, transmitted problems. And um, often people go on with life forgetting that these things are there and they exist. And sometimes they can, you know, in a long run, you know, hold one back or, you know, prevent one from becoming where they should be or where they want to be, you know, due to those um certain factors so on this video i'll be touching on that and talking about um those um, um impacts that, ha that that relationships have on our lives and moving forward it's very important to understand that we are all spiritual people you know and it's very important to take care of your inner self at all times you know and these days um nothing is as pure you know as it was because everything is now accessible to everyone and anyone and things like umuti things like easy that people use or to enhance um things in relationships you know might be far-fetched but that is the reality of things and these things often have a negative impact on both a male and a female in the long run even after the relationships have ended you know so it's very important to understand that as a person or, or, or rather frequently you need to look after yourself cleanse yourself and do all these other things just to look after yourself because it's very important so now we all have what I call is our spiritual imprints or someone might call our spiritual DNA, which is something we carry inside us. And how we get to exchange all these elements I'm talking about is through contact via being intimate. That is through sex with the, the, the next party or rather this person or rather that person. And um, oftentimes people overlook that and think, you know, you know, one might say, oh, all my chakras and stuff. No, I'm trying to make you understand this in a more simple way that you are able to get help for yourself and understand things better and not find yourself being in the same situation constantly. So now, everyone we come across Ubanama spiritual DNA or other imprints that they leave on their lives and Nazi that we leave on that person's life. So now, it's very important as you always say that from relation to relationships, you need to cleanse, you know, don't just jump into a relationship. You need to cleanse yourself of that previous relationships imprint or other dna you know because what happens is that you don't change yourself and all these imprints come into your life um i want you to think of yourself as a glass a, a, a nice beautiful glass vase um with all these fingerprints of all these people you you have been in relationships so that is also the same thing with your spiritual self when you do not change yourself when it's necessary and all these other elements that's what happens to you so it's very important that you change yourself of every relationship because sometimes what happens is this it becomes a disadvantage where you find yourself attracting or rather being in a relationship and similar things happen like like how, what I mean by similar things happen. What happened in your previous relationship outplays itself in the next relationships and in the next relationships and so on and so on. And you find yourself that, oh, I'm not the problem or he's not the problem. Ganti. It's these imprints, it's these energies that you carry with you that force the situation to, to be like that. Someone might ask, why are all my relationships, people come to me, they promise me marriage, but when it's time for things to, you know, come into manifestation the guy just disappears all the guys disappear like what happens or i date guys and every guy i date Njalo, when you're about to get married they either commit suicide or they die you know fatal you know ways and um 
not understanding that there are imprints you carry with you that you never got rid of and when you meet that particular person and um, you transfer or rather you know those imprints and it's deeper with females because we are 80 percent of the time carriers and it's a sad story for guys because 80 percent of the times they are receivers of this imprint now what happens to a male counterpart that receives this imprint from a female counterpart um they tend to draw the same energy they tend to have the same energy you'd find someone complaining with you ever since i've been in the relationship this person has changed me for the worst you know this person has did this this person because of this imprint that we often overlook as people and the sad part is that these days you know all over people use um there are things that okay there are things that people use, you know, for men. Um, especially in Zotin Amat Besazani, we are gazing along a panty, goodness into Esfara and a panty, um, who goes in Tampa Massifi, Lesos Catileso, um, window that you know, you know, I sometimes feel sorry for men. I'm sorry, but the things that you guys get to go through and unaware it's very painful. Um, there are things that people use that are under their beds, there are people that, like things are rough you know so you can imagine you dating a person and you they do these things to you and you meet the same per, the next person and they do these things to you imagine all this energy you carrying inside you basically all of this can't you know maybe people see particular things in your life at that time because 80 percent of the time what leads people to act like this is greed so they see what they see and then the next thing they want to manipulate the whole situation and then unfortunately when we listen to that people go to an extent of feeding people their their menses you know uh, like it's so creepy but it happens you know it happens um there are things that are there i always say that as women when you know or rather when you find yourself having to go for a partner or rather someone you, you claim you love that person is not for you that person is not yours because what is yours will happen you know what is yours will allow and all these other things these are all nice words but when you find yourself having to go through extreme lengths to keep a person to have a person then you need to know because with that notion of that you need to use something for a man but the trick is don't use for a man use for yourself to keep your, your like protect your inner self that is why i'm saying if it's for you to cleanse your your inner you your outer you so that you don't have all these fingerprints on your body then no harsh feelings but the problem starts when it's for someone else you know um it's no it's no different than forcing someone to love you <laughs> it's just that you're manipulating the situation at that time and there are always these elements that are there so I, I would always say to all men like disclaimer guys look after yourself cleanse yourself do all these things because there are so many things that happen that you're not aware of and not aware something is being dropped in your drink or something like there's there's a lot there's a lot it's too much to, to 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 just grasp you know in one you know thing so um it's important to understand that that these imprints are important to get rid of because everyone's weakness is through sexual contact sex is everyone's weakness so now the only way to help yourself of this is to get rid and cleanse yourself of your inner self and remain pure you know all these other elements and for tina you know someone like you know, I'm poor. What are you talking about? How do I cleanse and all these other things? Tolomoto zogeza, you know, make it an annual thing, or rather, every six months, get the cleansing. You know, there's nothing wrong with cleansing, um, but it's very important and imperative to everyone for us. To, it's like how we push our reset button, you know, because sometimes you find um everything is going well for you, but there's always these problems when it comes to relationships, or you are attracting a similar pattern in your relationships. Um, 
it's these imprints it's these imprints and sometimes you might find a good yes you might cleanse yourself of the of these imprints but what about the next person you meet how do they cleanse themselves how do they even know how do you even know that they did cleanse themselves if it's a mutual relationship and all of that and you can sit down and discuss moving forward and if there's not Listen, hun, protect yourself at all times, even if it means you are happy in that relationship. But every now and then, make sure that you cleanse yourself of these imprints because that is why you find sometimes you in relationships and you end up connecting to people's exes, unaware, dreaming of certain things and, you know, certain things, certain things. Because why I'm saying it's imprints, the minute you meet or rather are intimate with someone, there is that connection, that spark you know, of the spiritual world, you know. So, I mean, it, it goes deeper, especially when you're a spiritual person, you know. Um, not everyone is, is, is trained or rather, you know, with, with a way to, to be able to block that and have that contact with people but not let them leave the imprints, you know. That is why even my young I cannot come into, uh, in my workspace or rather into Minami after being intimate you know um it's not just because of it like in any but in all effect and but in all effect in prince law and won't a spiritual baggage yeah okay trust me and sometimes you find yourself your things are going okay you know but as soon as you meet certain people or certain person things started crumbling and then even after post that relationship things still do not make sense so 80 percent of the time people tend to look outwards and not look inwards not understanding that we all have something to contribute to everything that we encounter so it's very important that these days you are very aware as a person domazana mvana mbudi cc um whoever you are watching this video and if you're watching this video and you're a spiritual person Goko, mkulu, you know you need to protect and sanctify because when a wears gay, like <laughs> your situation is deep. But for someone looking at this video, um, there are so many ways to change yourself. You know, I know someone might think, oh, I need to get gems, I need to get stones, and all these other things. Like how you help yourself is totally up to you. Sing abanto as funny. We relate to things differently, but I always you'll never go wrong with water 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 is like hello you know you can never go wrong with water i might say i'm humble just to go there be in touch with your inner self and just get rid of all those unnecessary toxins and blah 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 and blah 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 so when the show goes you are always you know ready for the next person be, you know i mean being human is another thing but being you know the spiritual person is a lot you know is a lot that is why i mean some people tend to you know still hold on to things you know like it's not because of you but it's those imprints that are stuck within your spirit so you need to be able um to rather let go and and cleanse yourself and help yourself and it's important for your sanity and all these other things because one kalama energy is lawa alaguwe you know you carry them with you you carry them even kapa you were you were dating someone oh bega shucha umoya for instance ushucha umoya and they don't know their way around isn't those abuza madlozi that imprint gets stuck on your life you find your spiritual life was going okay but after this pip person you know you know also aimlessly wondering you know uh, for example you find someone um you know egibo like there's a lot of things that are there kumbule kunabantu are facing generational curses kunabantu um there is just a lot of things you know um it don't like do not trust someone with your life if i'm making sense always trust yourself with your life and um Yes, manipulate if you want. That's your decision. But always know that there are um, effects after that. You don't get the effects. I think it's slightly say I'm too tired. So relevant. One day we are aging. You know, we're gonna age. It's about what about dollar and all these things that are happening around us that look quick and fast and you know doable. They end up having a negative impact in the long run. It might not be you, but your kids. You know, so it's very important to to understand all these other things. So um, that's just how we are, and it's worse when 
your partner is having multiple people or you are having multiple people but when you are having multiple <laughs> multiple people in your life that's also a problem you know because it's all these imprints like think of yourself as a, a, a network tower you are all, you are just getting from these cell phones you know you are the tower your person is the tower and i connect to gula i'm a i'm a phony like it's it's a lot so sometimes you just need to just you know you know get dread because no matter whether you attend or attend you your ex's imprint yes i love you but they may think that they have an ex or someone they dated. Oh, to look at someone you want um, you know, um, um, miscarried or had an abortion and all these other things. Those imprints are sala. So go now this big exchange we know that way because we are far away. It's in our best for Zani Nazis. They are transfer. Listen, I'm about to have like it's a network that is very toxic, but it's very important to understand that life is spiritual i always say this everything is spiritual you need to look out for yourself there used to be a time when none of these things were discussed but because there are people like us you know that are there to shed the light and make you aware that it's not everything you need to be scared and like oh i need to go like no just get help necessary help where you want to get help or help yourself whatever works for you and be sorted and know that life is spiritual no matter how you look at it life is very spiritual R right now your things are falling apart you don't know what happened mara you are like you know what you never know that's why i'm saying you need to tick all the boxes before you reach the conclusion you're good i am a juicy angry i tell you don't just make conclusions they are always imprints that are always going to be in our lives and guys i repeat i repeat open your eyes <laughs> and it's not just guys even with girls they open your eyes these guys are no longer as innocent as we thought they, or dumb you know they know things they do things they use things you know so it's rough out here but anyway um thank you so much for viewing my video um i hope this is very informative and till we meet again thank you so much i'm probably